All right, guys, here we are, November 6th, two days post Olympia out here in Orlando, Florida. This is honestly the, probably the first time I've had a chance to relax in months. This morning, we finished up our last shoot. I shot with VQ and the guys, Team USA. We had um, Breon, Blessing, Tristan, and Ryan out there. And it was really cool. Me and Breon talked a lot about, you know, our thoughts on how we placed and, you know, what we can do better for next year. And it was just um, a good time to get together with the guys and, and wrap up this 2023 Olympia season. We have a lot of content coming for you guys. It's been super busy out here. Like it's been nonstop from the time I wake up to the time I fall asleep. Thursday, I was up at 5 a.m. and I didn't get to bed till like, I didn't leave, leave Meet the Olympians till like 11.30 at night. And then didn't get to bed till like one. Sleep's been minimal. So I'm really looking forward to tonight and actually being able to sleep in tomorrow a little bit. But we have the Meet the Olympians video coming out. We have a full day vlog of that. And then we also have a show day vlog coming for you guys. But I just want to give you guys a brief update. You know, Olympia was a great experience overall. You know, obviously I didn't place where I wanted to, but you know, going into this Olympia, I knew it was going to be a challenge. I knew I was facing some of the best athletes I've ever seen on stage in my life. So, and that's what it was. The guys that I was competing against were amazing. And I got to step my game up. I got to bring a better package. You know, I got to time things differently. We didn't necessarily come in at 100%. And, you know, that's something that's kind of been sitting on me a little bit heavy is that I didn't bring the best physique I've had this prep to the stage. And that's just part of bodybuilding. Sometimes you hit it on time and sometimes you don't. And unfortunately in the morning, we missed the mark and that's when the most of judging gets done. So um, it's a learning experience, but the thing is, I'm, I see that I'm, I'm, I'm still there, I'm still capable, and I can still see myself moving up and winning the Mr. Olympia title. It's still something that's very, very possible. So I just gotta continue to get back to work this year, make some adjustments my off season and, and get better. Um, overall, I'm gonna be diving into a lot more in-depth things about this prep in our last video. We have like a mini documentary style video we're going to be putting out together to wrap up this whole 2023 Olympia. We documented a lot of stuff for you guys. I wanted you guys to be a part of it this whole time. We started the six months out, you know, getting you guys involved and shooting videos on a weekly basis. And it's been a process that you guys have seen me start from, you know, a point where a lot of people thought it wasn't possible to placing eighth in the world again. I learned a lot along this journey and I'm going to open up a lot and share a lot of those things with you in that last video. So I'm really looking forward to putting that out there. And again, I appreciate you guys' support along this way. You know, I feel like we've all grown together and um, 2024 is a new year. It's gonna be a new me and we're gonna continue to get better. I'm coming after that title, 2024. Yes, sir. 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 Y